What is up guys, Killer Kevin today back with a brand new episode of 5 new console mods to hit the Bethesda on a website this week. This is going to be episode 532 within my series, but without further ado guys, let's just jump straight into the video. Immersive Roads, coming in at 15.7 megabytes of a download. This is going to be a port from the NexusMods.com, a complete retexture of Skyrim's road utterly. Guys, this is going to be covering all of the roads within Tamriel itself. The mod author highly recommends using the mod along with the Tamriel Reloaded AIO or Tamriel Reloaded AIO. Although any snow mods would be absolutely fine and will cover those roads and work perfectly fine with these ones. Overall, my setup worked absolutely a treat. Yours should work too. I don't see how there's going to be any issues with this particular mod, but overall was really excited to see that this did cover absolutely every single road within my game. Crazy, but also looks absolutely insane. Dragonborn Cliff Player Home Public Test Phase. This one is coming in at 608.3 kilobytes of a download. Now we have covered this particular mod on the channel before when it first came out absolutely ages ago, but the mod author is tinkering and tampering with loads of other different things of that older mod and sort of changing different things to do with the physics bugs and loads of other different things as well. Just wants to make a polished mod. This is an updated version of that particular mod and it is going to be in the testing phase for who knows knows how long hopefully not too long I really did enjoy this one once upon covering it when it first came out and it is an absolute joy to go back to it now I didn't have any issues back in the day not too sure if there was for any other players but for me it's nice to see that old mod authors are coming back and rectifying and looking at some of the old particular content and maybe fixing it that is awesome to see that they are improving pushing forward and producing great content this particular player home will be coming with all of your standard crafting vanilla stations also as well a few other different goodies but overall it is an absolute extreme player home there's so many other different rooms and the intent to detailing is absolutely astonishing guys this is only a test phase but all i could say for that download size is get it and try it out probably keep it on your load order as this is a very unique and interesting player home the great city of dragon bridge coming in at 1.8 megabytes of a download as i said in the last video we did cover dawnstar and i said in that video too that we will be covering more of these in quotations the great city of so and so end quotation this is going to be absolutely beautiful it adds so much to dragon bridge itself it is unbelievable not only does it add a beautiful cobblestone feel castle wall around the perimeter which looks absolutely gorgeous it adds loads of other different things within the quotation hold itself too not only do you get a beautiful fenced off hold you get loads of other different interior things within this settlement i absolutely adore with this particular overhaul i think it's very nice indeed there's going to be so much sort of a particular there's actually a little backstory if you guys want to read up on that but for me aesthetics is going to be what i'm taking away from this particular mod imperial agents 1992 executioner magini follower coming in at 9.6 kilobytes of a download adds a magini as a follower from resident evil 5 hopefully i am pronouncing that correctly inspired from executioner this particular flow is absolutely devastating. I was a little bit spoofed while watching the mod author's video, own video, shall I say, on the channel on how OP this character was. But once upon entering solitude, he will pretty much present himself as he is. And then he will have an extra sort of set of clothing and a weapon for you guys to pick up as well. So you both can double team as an executioner. But for this particular follower was absolutely devastating. It was pretty much one-shotting everyone, which I couldn't believe at all. Comes with a couple of different things he is going to be starting at level 25 and leveling up with the player all the way up to level 300 perks include such things as fighting stance bladesman champion starts hack and slash custom fit limb splitter skull crusher there's going to be devastating blow tower of strength and extra damage is going to be a 1.5 there's going to be a bio of this particular follower i don't think how it would work very well within skyrim but overall a very very cool build i suppose you could relate it to the executioner within solitude but overall 
did enjoy this follower. Very overpowered, looks great, and personally, was pretty fun to play with. The Great City of Fulcreef, coming in at 507.7 kilobytes of a download. This is going to be another one of those mods that we did talk about literally probably about two minutes ago, but this one is going to be a port from the nexusmods.com and it pretty much does the exact same thing as all of the other particular ones. It adds an overwhelming amount of detailing to these holds and settlements. Guys, I highly suggest you grab all of these right now. The download size is really low for what you actually get. It completely changes the game. Not only do you get within the Fall Creef, you do get a beautiful, I don't even know what it is. It's like a massive sort of, uh, sort of church or a palace or a barracks. I'm not too sure, but you'll see that in a minute. Obviously, as well, you get the standard uh, sort of castle wall surrounding the hold itself. And uh, overall, it is great it immersives on the graveyard side of things too there's a few little detailing scattered around through that it's not just a bunch of stuff added on top as well they've looked back at the existing things to do with full grief and enhanced those too they're absolutely gorgeous i think it's really cool indeed and uh, definitely does amplify these holds to a whole nother level so guys that's the end of this particular video hopefully you guys did enjoy this has been episode 532 within my series guys if you're new around here and you haven't done thus so make sure to click that subscribe button it does help me out an awful lot and we are very close to 15 thousand subscribers it is going to be absolutely awesome it's kind of a mid-year goal for me but we're getting there extremely quick and i'm over the moon with that guys if you have subscribed and you like the video already and you want to go above and beyond make sure to click that little bell it will give you a notification in some way shape or form every single time i post a video like this to the channel but guys until the next one killer kefir and killer gev out